Tell them our frustration, show them the petition, and show them that we are we, we need to stand up. We need to stand up for our rights because, like everyone, most of you here, if you want to raise your hand, that you looked for this for a long-term investment, and this is it's kind of like your retirement fund that you want to go on. And it's, now that it's, this is put in the way, you're not going to be able to have that investment like you wanted to. Um, contact Kathleen Wynn. Anyone can email me. I can send you all of her contact information. She's the Minister of Municipal Affairs and Housing. She, I have sent her all of my stuff. She, she knows what's going on. They will be addressing the Municipal Act in some way or form, but we need to know this is what we want and this is what we want now. Um, please, tell your friends, tell your family. Tell your family about the petition, get them to sign it. Anyone over the age of 14 can sign because it does affect everyone. It's a rippling effect. Um, we're going to be able to get our, our, our collective voices heard a little bit more if we're just constantly up there and showing them, hey, it's here, it's on the fridge, it's, it's on the mailboxes, like this is how far I want to get this. And we're getting more and more cities, like we have Ottawa, Nipissing, Windsor, we have, uh, where is Bud? Bud's from Peterborough. Oh, there he is. <laughs> so in his, in his uh, we have Bob. I'm sorry I didn't catch your last name, but they, they traveled all the way down here to be here because they want to have, they want this stop just as much as all of us do. Um, another thing that we are doing is making sure that we're letting the media, the media know about what's going on. But most of all, we just, we need your strength. We need, uh, we need your strength to make this happen. And the only way to do this is starting to get up there and get the petitions handed out to real estate agents, property managers, uh, everyone that you can see that works for the landlord, get it to them because we need help. We 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 really do. And I'm uh, I'm still working on it. Two years later. <laughs> so I just uh, I just want to thank you for your support and your help coming down. And like I said, if we don't do something now, hydro, gas, dog licensing, it's going to be next. So um, I'm going to leave a, it up to uh, get some great speakers here tonight, and they're going to be able to give their input on the on uh, what the issue is at hand and how we can act on it. Hear that? Yes. How long before you're going to? How long are you going to collect petitions? We're going to be collecting petitions right up until we get the results we want. It's it's just going to be on her test. She's going to all oh, go. Oh, okay. Uh, I think we've got to deal with something now. <laughs> but you know what, the best thing that is working right now is that the Municipal Act is up for review every five years, and this is the year. So if we're going to make noise, we need to make noise now. Because this is, it's, they, we've got them in the papers, we're getting it in other uh, municipalities' papers. We're just really making sure that we're not going away. And as long as that we're a team, like we're a team here right now, we're not... We're not organization, we're not nonprofit housing, we're just here as individuals and we're representing each other. And especially from the landlords associations that are here, they're representing their their uh, their members right now as we speak. So it's going to be, because uh, everyone, it's just point blank, you don't pay for someone else's debt. Bottom line. Yeah. All right, uh, just to, to address your question a little bit further, sir, and for everybody else in the room, we do have a series of speakers tonight, and there will be an opportunity at the end of the speakers to ask all your questions, not, not to diminish the importance of that question whatsoever. Uh, so again, to drive home the importance of what Kayla just said is ultimately, uh, we need the strength of our collective voice, and part of doing that is to sign the petition and express your support for this very important issue. We have Sue Taylor and Tom Van at the back of the room, as well as Jan Leggett, who are very happy to uh, turn around because they're waiting. They're looking very happy. Uh, they're very. They will be 